Hello what is up everybody, welcome to a brand new Fallout 76 video. Today we're going to tell you how you get modifications for your weapons, therefore making them much better out in the wasteland, and enabling you to tune the weapons to your playstyle. So the first step is to get a bunch of duplicates of the weapon you want to get modifications for. Some weapons do not have modifications, however, such as the Kami Whacker which you find in the fair location. However, some weapons do, or most weapons do should I say. As you can see, I dismantle a bunch of hunting rifles and get a bunch of modifications in return. I also dismantle a bunch of duplicate short pump action shotguns and again get a bunch of mods for that. However, I'm not getting the mods straight up. As you can see, what it does is it gives you the ability to craft these mods. These mods will still cost a bunch of scrap so make sure you still stock up as much as you can on your scrap before you go and craft some weapon mods. As you can see what I did to my pump action is I made it have a long barrel instead of the default short barrel, therefore giving it a bunch more range, which is something you definitely want on a shotgun. And as you can see with my hunting rifle, I had a bunch of stuff unlocked. However, as I said, these modifications still cost scrap and I did not have much, as I had just died and I was not able to go and collect my scrap as there was a bunch of super mutants and I was under level. I hope this short guide helped you figure out how you modify your weapons, as it is a little bit different than it was in Fallout 4. Another method to modify your weapons is to buy the mods straight up from a vendor. However, I don't know if it was a bug because this is in the beta or I couldn't figure it out, but I had a modification that I bought from a vendor but it was not available when I went to craft it. It may be the case that you have to open your Pip-Boy and push A on the modification to unlock it. However, I did not think to do that in the short time I had in the beta, as there was plenty of stuff that I wanted to do. And aside from that, that is all for the video. If you guys have any questions about crafting modifications for your weapons, pop them down below in the comments and I'll do my best to answer them. And apart from that, I ask you to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel for plenty more Fallout 76 content. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video.